The web's glance is so far reaching that it captures light which has journeyed for over 13 billion years. Due to the continuous expansion of the universe, this light has stretched and shifted, allowing us to peer back in time, nearly to the dawn of everything we know. The universe may seem incomprehensibly vast today, but its origins trace back to a single, unimaginably dense point referred to as the singularity. This idea, central to the Big Bang theory, has long shaped our understanding of cosmic beginnings. Yet, recent revelations made by the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, have begun to reshape what we thought we knew. The JWST, a marvel of modern engineering, has opened new windows into the birth and evolution of the cosmos. Its observations are prompting renowned physicists like Brian Cox to suggest that we may need to fundamentally rethink our view of the universe. With images sharper and deeper than any before, the telescope has unveiled cosmic structures we never imagined could exist so early in time. It's not just revealing distant galaxies, it's rewriting history. This extraordinary instrument is the product of decades of collaboration between NASA, the European Space Agency, and the Canadian Space Agency. Unlike its predecessor, the Hubble Space Telescope, which primarily used visible and ultraviolet light, the JWST operates in the infrared spectrum. This allows it to see through thick cosmic dust clouds, unveiling celestial phenomena that were previously invisible. Its 6.5-meter gold-coated primary mirror, composed of 18 hexagonal segments, enables it to collect more light than any telescope before it. Orbiting at the second Lagrange point, or L2, about 1.5 million kilometers from Earth, the JWST maintains a stable, unobstructed view of the cosmos. Its location is crucial. It keeps the Sun, Earth, and Moon behind it, minimizing thermal interference and maximizing the clarity of its images. As it gazes into the farthest reaches of the cosmos, the telescope doesn't just measure distance, it traverses time. Each beam of light it captures from distant galaxies took billions of years to arrive, allowing us to witness the universe as it was eons ago. Thanks to redshift, the stretching of light waves due to the universe's expansion, ancient light from the early universe has been shifted from visible to infrared wavelengths. That's where the JWST excels. It can detect these faint infrared signals, enabling scientists to study the formation of stars, the assembly of galaxies, and even the atmospheres of distant exoplanets. One of its most striking discoveries so far is the identification of enormous masses of galaxies at the edge of the observable universe, an unexpected finding that challenges long-standing assumptions about how galaxies form and evolve. To appreciate how revolutionary this is, it helps to understand the broader context of space exploration. Ancient civilizations like the Greeks and Chinese tracked planetary motion and developed rudimentary models of the cosmos. In the 17th century, Isaac Newton's laws of motion and gravity provided a theoretical framework that propelled scientific discovery. Then, in the early 20th century, Edwin Hubble fundamentally altered our understanding of the cosmos by discovering that distant galaxies were moving away from us, proving that the universe is expanding. His observations laid the foundation for the Big Bang Theory. The space race of the mid-20th century, fueled by Cold War rivalry, accelerated humanity's venture into the cosmos. From the launch of Sputnik in 1957 to the Apollo moon landing in 1969, space exploration advanced rapidly. Then came the Hubble Space Telescope in 1990, which delivered breathtaking images and revolutionized observational astronomy. Hubble's achievements, including the famous pillars of creation and the deep field images, revealed the incredible richness of the cosmos and hinted at countless galaxies far beyond our own. But Hubble had limitations. It couldn't effectively see through interstellar dust or detect the faint infrared glow of the earliest galaxies. That's where the JWST enters the picture. Designed to expand upon Hubble's legacy, the JWST allows astronomers to look further back in time than ever before, back to a period just a few hundred million years after the Big Bang, during what is known as the Cosmic Dawn. The Big Bang theory posits that the universe began 13.8 billion years ago from an extremely hot and dense point. 
As it expanded and cooled, particles combined to form atoms, which later coalesced into stars, galaxies, and larger cosmic structures. One of the major pillars supporting this theory is the existence of cosmic microwave background radiation, first detected in 1965, which is considered a remnant of the early universe. Despite its wide acceptance, the Big Bang theory hasn't gone unchallenged. Alternative ideas, like the steady-state theory, once competed for acceptance, arguing that the universe has always existed in a constant state. However, the discovery of cosmic background radiation and the redshifted light from distant galaxies solidified the Big Bang as the dominant theory. Still, discrepancies remained, many of which the JWST is now helping to explore. Thanks to its advanced infrared instruments, the JWST can peer into dense star-forming regions and capture phenomena invisible to Hubble. Its ability to observe faint, cooler objects such as brown dwarfs and distant exoplanets adds to its versatility. The telescope has revealed a surprisingly high number of ancient galaxies, many of which appear to be more developed than models predicted. This suggests that the early universe may have evolved more quickly and more intricately than we once believed. What's particularly astonishing is the size and structure of these early galaxies. Based on existing models, such large, well-formed structures shouldn't have been able to form so soon after the Big Bang. Their presence indicates that our understanding of galactic evolution is incomplete. This challenges fundamental principles in cosmology and raises important questions about the nature of the universe's first few hundred million years. The JWST's discoveries are also prompting scientists to revisit models of large-scale structure formation. The cosmic web, the vast network of galaxies and dark matter connecting them, appears denser and more complex than previous observations suggested. These findings hint at new, possibly unknown physical processes or interactions that shaped the early cosmos. If verified, they could force a re-evaluation of long-standing assumptions, including those related to dark matter, dark energy, and the rate of cosmic expansion. The use of spectroscopy, analyzing the light emitted or absorbed by matter, has been key in uncovering these secrets. By examining the spectral fingerprints of light, scientists can determine the chemical composition, temperature, and motion of celestial objects. The JWST has already delivered surprising results. For instance, while early theories suggested that ancient galaxies would primarily consist of lighter elements like hydrogen and helium, Spectroscopic data revealed heavier elements and more complex compounds much earlier in the universe's timeline than anticipated. These findings extend to the realm of exoplanets as well. The JWST is capable of analyzing the atmospheres of distant worlds with incredible precision. It can detect signs of water vapor, methane, carbon dioxide, and other organic molecules, elements considered vital for life. These discoveries provide crucial clues in the search for potentially habitable worlds beyond our solar system. In the realm of star formation, the JWST is also making significant contributions. Stars are born in dense molecular clouds shrouded by dust, areas where visible light can't penetrate. With its infrared vision, the JWST can peer into these stellar nurseries and capture the earliest stages of star formation. This data is helping scientists understand the processes that lead to the creation of solar systems like our own. Yet, as with all groundbreaking research, early interpretations can evolve. Initial observations that suggest specific structures or chemical compositions may be revised as more detailed data becomes available. What begins as a glimpse into the unknown often reveals a far more complex and nuanced reality upon deeper investigation. This is the nature of scientific progress, it adapts and grows with new evidence. The JWST has already demonstrated that our universe is more dynamic, more varied, and more mysterious than we ever imagined. Its findings are challenging our assumptions, sparking debates, and inspiring new models to explain what we see. From the birth of stars to the assembly of galaxies to the composition of exoplanets, Every discovery brings us closer to understanding our place in the vast cosmic tapestry. The telescope's work is just beginning. As it continues to gather light from the farthest reaches of space, it will undoubtedly unveil more surprises that will force us to rethink everything, 
from the moment time began to the ultimate fate of the cosmos. The journey into the past, enabled by this remarkable instrument, promises to illuminate not just how the universe began, but why it exists in the form we now observe.